Getting tested for STIs can feel a little overwhelming or even scary. These are all common concerns, but hopefully we can ease them by showing you what STI testing looks like at the Student Health Center. Many people think they would know if they had an STI, but the truth is that many STIs show no signs or symptoms. Even if someone has mild symptoms, they can easily be overlooked since many symptoms mimic other infections. The only way to know for sure if you or your partner, or partners, have an STI is to get yourself tested. As long as you're sexually active, the CDC recommends you should get tested for STIs at least once a year. If you have a new partner, or more than one partner, have anonymous sex partners, share intravenous needles, or infrequently use berry methods, such as condoms or dental dams, you should consider getting tested every three to six months. To book an appointment, you can call the Student Health Center at 812-855-7688, or if you prefer, schedule online on the website. Click Make an Appointment on the homepage, and make sure to read through the following steps. They're super helpful if you've never been a patient here before. When you're ready, click Schedule an Appointment online, and follow the directions on the screen. You'll receive a confirmation email with the date, time, and location of your appointment. On the day of your appointment, please arrive 15 minutes early to complete pre-appointment paperwork. Students will receive an appointment reminder through their IU email. This email will include what door they should use to enter the building. First, you will fill out a form on their phone and, or one of the health center's iPads. Then you are called into the exam room to discuss your sexual health history with your provider to determine which tests are needed. We will talk about any symptoms you're having, if any, the number of partners you've had sex with, the kind of sexual contact you've had, either oral, anal, or vaginal sex, how often you use condoms or dental dams, or other things you might do that might increase your risk of infection, like sharing needles. It's important to come prepared to answer these questions and to be honest with your healthcare provider. There is not one test for all STIs. Some tests are body site specific, meaning the location you have sex is where the specimen should be collected. Being honest with your provider will determine the most appropriate test based on your conversation. Some tests may require a specimen collection or a blood test. After the initial health screening, you may obtain self-collection materials from the lab and you'll return them back to the lab when you're finished. Once your appointment is complete, your results are available in one to three business days. You will only receive a call from your health provider if your result is positive. However, you can view your results, negative or positive, in the online patient portal once they become available. No worries, your result will remain confidential. You might feel a little embarrassed or even afraid if you receive a positive result, but I promise you're not alone. People with STIs can have sex, be in healthy relationships, and live happy and healthy lives. It just means you're a human who happened to get an infection. The sooner you get tested and treated for an STI, the better. Some STIs have a high reinfection rate, so it's important that all partners get tested and treated. The best thing to do when you find out you have an STI is to follow your health provider's directions for treating it by taking all your medication as prescribed and refrain from any sexual contact for a week following the finishing of the medication. Most, most STIs are curable with medicine and all of them can be treated to minimize symptoms and to lower the risk of transmission to your sexual partners. It's also important to communicate with your sexual partners about your past sexual history, especially if your test comes back positive, so they can also get testing and treatment if needed. Using barrier methods like condoms and dental dams, getting tested and communicating with partners about your testing status is the best way to keep ourselves healthy. Together, we can keep one another safe. If you have any questions about sexual health or want to learn more about clinic hours, visit the IU Student Health Center website for more information. Also, you can sign up for our program, Safer Sex Express, where IEB students select Safer Sex Supplies and have them mailed directly and discreetly to your residence in the United States for free. 